Hi everyone. I know I said I wouldn't be live today. Um, normally I do a sped up video, but so much time got away from me yesterday that I did not get to make a sped up video. So I am live with you guys. Surprise. <laughs> All right. So I'm going to send this over to my VIP group. If you are not in the VIP group and you are not a chalk couture designer and you would love to be there, let me know. I will get you over there. Today is the 25th. 23. All right. Sometimes I can see comments when they pop on. Sometimes I can't. So we're still going to continue the Americana theme. I'm going to do the other three box frames. I actually have two of these that actually already have something on them. And we're just going to flip them over and do the other sides. So we're going to use this transfer right here. This is the one that is called Land of the Free, which actually comes back today, which is amazing. We also have a cutout that is going to launch with it. The cutout, you can put this little banner right here on. And I want to say the eagle. I'm not sure what else, guys. So I think the America is the other one. So we are going to use these, <clears throat> just pieces of them, on our um, drop-in box frames. Of course, you know that I've used this piece already. So I've actually used this one one time so far. Hold on, let me set this down here. We are going to actually do the eagle, and we're going to do the eagle in um, an ombre effect. We're going to do home of the brave and the stars on another one. And then we're going to do um, land of the free, but I'm going to kind of, I'm not going to cut it, but I'm going to do land of and then go down and do of the, or, um, the free. So let me find my transfer term. See, today is one of those days, guys. I am lost. I didn't get much sleep last night. Um, my cat's got a vet appointment tomorrow. I finally, um, I mean, she rested pretty much all night. Um, I'm just hoping that she's going to be fine because our animals are just like our kids. All right, we're going to do the eagle. Um, land of the free, and then the home of the brave with the stars. We're doing everything with Candy Apple Red and Cadet. Now, if you're not, you don't like that deep blue, we do have a lighter blue called Colonial Blue. It's really, really pretty. Works really well with the, um, with the candy apple. We also have another one that's even lighter than that, and that's Lakeshore. Um, and then, of course, you can keep going down. We have, like, Ocean Mist and stuff like that. So let's do the stars and the banner first. Um, if you are, if you see a transfer and you love it, you can make it patriotic or um, Americana by doing um, it in those colors. So don't think that just because it's traditionally not that way, um, you can totally do that. I've done it many times. Like um, when I first <clears throat> started, I started in April. 2020 I did not have any of that kind of stuff I didn't even have Christmas stuff um, and we were doing Christmas in July and I didn't have any because I didn't I wasn't part of that um, and so I used regular transfers and just changed the colors and they looked really good so don't think that just because it's not traditionally in that way you can't do it think outside the box All right, let's actually do the eagle first. We're going to do the eagle first, just because that's the one that's right here. Let's sit over here. We're going to buzz it. So we're going to go from red to blue, and then we'll ombre effect it. So 
actually what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab a small squeegee and <clears throat> probably two small squeegees just to get the coverage done. All right, I'm going to move you guys down so you guys can actually see what I'm doing a lot better. You guys down. Okay, so the box frame, we're actually going to keep it like this. Um, that's just how we're going to do it. The eagle technically would be offset, and that would probably drive my OCD a little crazy, so I'm going to offset it myself. That's candy apple and cadet. Sorry about that, guys. Um, String this up. Because you always want to stir it. It's just like paint. Okay. So I'm going to start with red. Kind of, I'm going to stop, I think, like right there at the top of the eagle's head. I'm going to set this down. Hold on. And go with the blue. Now this is how I do the ombre effect. I take a little bit of each color. And I just kind of dab it on. I put the rest of it back into the jar. Off my fingers. Always using the wet um, baby wipes because it gets your finger wet and it's easier to spread the paste when it's wet than when it's not. Cleaning my hands off. To you guys. So the middle kind of almost looks black because of the two colors blended together, but it actually looks really, really cool. A little tiny bit up here. Wipe that off. I got paste for some odd reason around my nail. I don't know how that happened. Okay, so we got that eagle. So we're going to drop it in the box frame. There it is, ready to go. Okay, so we got one done. Now let's work on the land of the free again. Another one done. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do land of and then the free. So I'm going to do one in red and one in blue. I'll probably do blue first. Um, you just want to make sure you fuzz it really well, of course. Okay, so it could fit on here. I could do that, and a little bit of the ends would be gone, which actually wouldn't be too bad. I could do it like that. You're going to go all the way to the edge. So we'll start with the blue. I think I like 
like this idea actually better. It's simple, but I, I like it. I like it that way. did it. There's Land of the Free. You can read it. It's a little bit, like I probably would pull it out just ever so slightly, but you can read that. Um, that's what is super cool about these box frames, is they are very versatile. Now this one, we are going to do um, vertically. We're going to do the, um, the Home of the Brave in red, and we're going to do the stars in blue. That's how we're going to do it. So we're still keeping with that theme. We're gonna have to go on an angle. I just noticed that because the home of the brave will not fit if we go the other way. All right, so we're gonna do blue. And of course, you know you can do this however you want. I'm not telling you guys this is just a you know a reference. This is not you have to do it like this. Just keep that in mind when you're creating anything. Create it for you or whomever you're creating it for. up this blue just so it doesn't dry out. Set it off to the side. Friday, Saturday, Sunday we'll have um, videos posting. So as always, um, if you have any questions, please let me know. Um, I am here to answer questions. Just because I'm not live doesn't mean I can't um, respond to you. Keep that in mind. And as always, there will, like I said, there will be a cart link on how to get all these goodies that we used here today. Close them out up. We have the home of the brave. What's great about these box frames too is you can paint them, you can stain them, sand them down, change them out, add a bow, whatever you want to do with them. We have this one. We have land of the free. And then we have our eagle. So you have all of these ready to go, awesome designs that are going to go up onto that shelf that's by my front door. I will take pictures and show you guys as soon as it is all put together and which will probably be in the next couple minutes and then I will post a cart link with this video on how to get all of the goodies I will see you guys on Tuesday and you guys have a fabulous holiday weekend and I'll talk to y'all soon bye guys <laughs>